Hey guys, how's it going? I just wanted to make a quick video about the rigid power source adapter and what I found out about them recently. So here they are. So at first, I assumed that there were two kinds or rather two models of the power source adapters. Now I found out that there are three, as far as I know it. Correct me if I'm wrong or if I'm missing any additional ones that I don't know of. So first off, we got this guy. Model number is right here. That's going to be Romeo 86072. Now this guy, this is the first one I bought. He only has a USB outlet. Once you insert the battery here, press this button right here. He'll light up and power will feed out through this USB outlet here. You can use this to charge your phone and tablet and whatnot. And you could possibly power up some other small electronical devices. Next up, we're going to have this guy right here. Model number is Romeo 86074. Now this one is from my heated jacket kit that I bought online from the Home Depot website. It went on clearance. Uh, of course, that will come with a jacket, charger, battery, and this guy, of course. Now, to continue, he has the USB outlet again and uh, the, uh, the power button. Once you press that, power will go through. Now, the difference is this guy won't light up for some reason. I'm assuming it's just an older model. That's why. Now, the other additional feature is he'll have this outlet. Now, this is for the heated jacket. And then, finally, in our third one. Model number should be right there. Give me a sec. Romeo 86073 Bravo. Now, this is my recent addition to my Rigid family. Now, this is from the Matte Light. I bought this online on the Home Depot website also. It was a special buy of uh, the Rigid Torch and the Matte Light, along with this adapter in it. And then when I meant Torch, I guess, uh, if I'm not mistaken, correct me again if I'm wrong. Uh, I believe somewhere in Europe, instead of saying flashlight, they say torches. I don't know why so this guy will also have this outlet and that's for the matte light same thing but in USB this one won't light up though when you press it I guess only with this guy when you press him he'll light up when he has a battery inserted so now the putting this guy the first one aside these two are the ones with similar attributes I guess or rather looks but once I tried to, let's say I accidentally interchanged the tools, the matte light and the jacket, uh, I found out you could not insert one into the other and vice versa. Now that just got me thinking. After finding that ab uh, about that, I actually looked at the model numbers and voila, they're actually different. And then another way to find out was is that the power source adapter for the matte light it actually says on the small descriptions here light output now i tried that on the matte light and it fit I tried this guy in the matte light it did not fit the, the only physical difference that i can actually see within these holes is that one pin is bigger than the other but now when it came in uh for the plug with the matte light and the heated jacket very very similar i could not even tell the difference but when inserting them into these guys oh, they just would not fit in the wrong power source adapter so i'm going to demonstrate that all right i'm back so we'll start with my rigid ja heated jacket rigid rigid so going back here in the back pocket that's where i'll find the the plug that goes in the power adapter yeah, yes so rigid heated jacket so this is the one for the heated jacket I'll insert him so he inserts right fully and nice and comfy uh, nice snug but when I try and insert it to the other one he, that's as far as he goes I just don't want to press really hard and break him so Next one is the matte light, recent edition. Oh, here he is.
once more. So now this oh damn it for the mat light power source adapter inserts fully well as you can see that's as full as it can get but that's nice and snug now going to the other one heated jacket one now it goes in but it's not all the way in so if you notice the gap right there bigger than the original one see that tiny gap versus slightly bigger gap but it does not turn it on when I found this out and how I actually found out is that when I grabbed just any of these power adapters I wanted to just test out the mat light grabbed any of them and then tried to power up found out it could not power up so that just led me curious why it was not working I thought it was broken defective but luckily it turned out that it wasn't so other than that thanks for watching